All right, guys, uh, just covering this quick update. So this update just dropped about nine hours ago, right? Uh, there's a lot of stuff in here, but the biggest change probably impacting the game will be the armament system. So there's two big changes to the armament system. Well, there's three, uh, like it's two that we really care about. One, they added Tetsudo and Circle Formation. I'm not gonna cover that. But two, they added the idea of a rare inscription. So rare inscription is supposed to be between common and then special inscription. To my knowledge, special inscriptions are like if you get Hunter, right? Like the, that's probably the best one for Wedge. That's if you win KVK, you have the option to buy Hunter uh, with your Conquest coin. And then if you open the Courier Station, I'm gonna open it now and you press this like A, right? You go to Superior, you see there's these armaments that you could get over here, right? So for example, for the Wedge, you get Balanced. And it's really, really good. Compared to like a common one where you get robust, you get three and a half percent health. This thing has like multiple parts to it and it's really good. Uh, you need eight of these uh, inscription shards to get it. So far, since the armament system released a little over a year ago now, I've only acquired five shards. So it's really hard to get. I'm sure there's some people that have gotten it, but for the most part, most people haven't gotten it yet. So to kind of release something that's in between the two, they released the rare inscription that's going to come out. I don't know exactly what's going to be in there yet, but you know they already said it. It's going to be better than the common ones and probably a little worse than the special ones. So it's like an, a, a bridge in between. The other one is they're going to release a transmutation stone. So right now we have this, I mean, uh, transmutation crystals. Right now we have transmutation stones, right? You could either use one, three, or five of them to reset uh, armaments. So if I open an armament here, and I open one with an inscription, I have the option to transmute. When you use up all 10, that's done, right? But now with a transmutation crystal, you can actually reset this and get 10 more chances. Uh, so far in the mail, what they talked about is you'll be able to get it during the KVK shop. So, I mean, a KVK achievement. So it's gonna there's gonna be a limit on how many you can get per KVK. And uh, I'm not saying I necessarily agree with this, but I understand why they're doing that. I actually even understand why they're doing the 10. Not saying it's the best way, but the reason why there's a limit is because if you don't put a limit on this, then the spenders, right, they could just max buy every uh, armament bundle. And then for the most part, they're gonna recycle most of them to get uh, transmutation stones. Then they're gonna keep transmuting. And eventually that gap between the people that have a lot of money to get really good uh, armaments versus the ones that don't have the money to just buy and then have to recycle a bunch of transmutation stones is gonna be really big. But if you put a limit of 10, all of a sudden people have to be a lot more careful and it's a lot harder to just blow a bunch of money to get like three, three and a half, three and a half, three and a half and get like the best stats right now. So the reason why I think they're making it um, where in KBK, like the season, like in KBK, that's a achievement is because you could reset it, but you don't have unlimited resets like in a, in a, <clears throat> just because just you could throw money at it, right? Because even if you have a bunch of money, you have, let's just say, an unlimited amount of transmutation stones, you'll still need enough of those crystals uh, just so it'll slow down the progress a little bit of uh, just maxing the armaments. I think that's to kind of slow down the progress. Okay, so I'm going to release another video because this actually completely changes the strategy uh, of transmuting. But right for now, you don't want to transmute anything. Even if you have the transmutation stones, don't transmute anything because one, having transmutation crystals is gonna change the strategy, but you actually want to wait for the rare inscriptions to come out. So if you look at the mail, let's go to the mail, and it talks about the rare inscriptions, right? This, is, this system is gonna be uh, launched on February 26th. So today is the 19th, so that's gonna be a week from now. And then when you go to the rare inscriptions, uh, if you go over here, they talk about how there's gonna be like a pity system. So for every 150 legendary armaments you recycle for a single formation, uh, one of those is gonna be rare or better, but they've recorded how many uh, each governor has acquired in the past. So they'll actually later be compensating you with those, okay? And if those are better than the regular uh, shards, you don't wanna waste your transmutation stones on uh, transmute. You don't want to risk your transmutation or armament crystals. What, are, what is that thing called? Let me look. You don't want to waste your transmutation stones on transmuting common inscriptions right now because you could actually get a rare inscription that's a lot better. And uh, 
for now, just kind of sit tight and then wait for the rare inscriptions to come and then you can actually use them, okay? Uh, I'm going to release another video today to actually give you the updated strategy. It's gonna make it a lot easier. Everyone can follow it, whether you're free to play or the highest spender. It actually completely simplifies the system on like the best strategy to go about it. So I'll release that video, look for it later today. But for now, just know, uh, don't use any transmutation uh, stones until the rare inscriptions come out. And then from there, you can actually kind of make a decision. Do you wanna transmute uh, what you already have or are the new inscriptions uh, worth a little bit more?